A lot of news is flying around regarding an XRP settlement, but I'm here to tell you with 100% certainty that the news is false. Yep, they're using you for views. And I'm going to use the SEC themselves as my source, and it will be undeniable. Get the lube if you need it. Don't mind the mannequin hand. Seriously, this is one of the videos that bugs me the most to make because there's so many freaking creators out there, so many news outlets out there, so many authors out there that are misrepresenting the news, using you for not only views, but exit liquidity on bullshit news. I, I hate it. We need to clean this stuff up. First, your comments. PD Man, dude, really? Yeah, dude, I'm about to show you 100% debunking, and this is total BS. Roger Hoffman says you can't fix stupid. So they're not actually getting smarter, but wiser. Well said. Bitcoin's sitting at 37,898. When we get to 38, we're going to get excited. E, 2045, XRP, 60.3 with XLM still under 12 cents at 11.9. XRP case between Ripple and the SEC could be settled today, November 30th. Why? With an official announcement from the regulator. Guess what? They're talking about meetings today, closed door meetings in a pivotal form of events. The US SEC is set to convene on a confidential meeting today. Oh my God, everyone, they're gonna talk about Ripple settlement. Watch what happens. Here's the meeting today. Sunshine Act notice, time and place, 2.15 p.m. Thursday, November 30th. Sunshine Act meetings, okay? First things first, the whole case with the SEC and Ripple is not the Sunshine Act. But wait a minute, you don't believe me. Guess what? They had a meeting on Monday, March 21st, 2022. Sunshine Act meetings. So were they talking about XRP settlement then? Because guess what? The subject line is exactly the same. Oh my gosh, maybe they settled a third time? Wait a minute, I'm predicting the future. Thursday, December 7th, 2023, they're going to have, what everyone, another meeting regarding the Sunshine Act. Again, nothing to do with Ripple and the SEC. Uh oh, wait a minute. Maybe they settled again on Thursday, March 2nd, 2023. Why? Because what everyone, they had another, oh my gosh, Sunshine Act meeting. Oh, pfft. So they settled with Ripple on February 23rd. Oh my gosh, what, how, why are we still dealing with the court case? Come on, everyone. Oh, but, but see, I told you you needed a bottle of the lube if this hurts. And if you're a maxi, and if the content creators that you watch are lying to you about crap like this, stop watching them. Unless you want it for like entertainment and like stupidity. Oh, dude, then grab the popcorn, knock back a few drinks, enjoy yourself. Make fun of the, the McRoders out there. That's fine with me. But check it out. Apparently, Thursday, December 8th of 2022. So over a year ago, guess what, everyone? Oh, Sunshine Act meetings. So when we go back to the original thing of, oh, they've got Sunshine Act meetings November 30th. And these morons out here are trying to spin views based on lying to you. And creators out there and influencers out there using you for exit liquidity, hoping for any pump they can get to clear some positions out while people out there trying to buy this as real news going, oh my gosh, there's a settlement. Buy more, buy more. And you're like, dude, it's not even real news. So there you have it. Sunshine Act meetings. Nothing to do with Ripple and the SEC, but oh man. How many people, holy crap, are you getting big, bud? How many people out there are going to lie to you, fake the funk about it, use emotion to get you to be their exit liquidity? No wonder the markets didn't move on this news. It's because when they looked at it, they saw, oh my gosh, Sunshine Act meetings. This has nothing to do with the case, so there's no reason to have price action. I dealt with the Sunshine Act myself in my professional career, and it had to do with whining and dining at doctors in exchange for products, right? Medical goods and services. Sunshine Act. So today, what I'm going to do is I'm going to play with the dog. And I wanted to thank everyone for watching. And I also wanted to say that I know it is hard sometimes to hear the truth. Dude, you're making this tough. It is hard to hear the truth sometimes. But the truth is important because that kind of news is the news that holds. So if you're watching videos out there about people telling you that today's the settlement day, 
I'd question them heavily because I just showed you that, man, we should have had the settlement date by now six, eight, ten, twelve, fifteen times. Oh, Sunshine Act meetings. Catch you later, everyone. Hey. What? What? What is wrong with you? Huh? What is wrong with you? What is wrong with you? Are they? In oh, they're not playing. Well, you're not getting that from her, sweetie.